Hi, my name is Rose Wepa. I'm a technical service specialist here at OxyChem with the Calcium Chloride Division. Today, I was going to talk with you about melting speed and specifically what differentiates melting speed between different deicers. So one of the key things that affects melt speed is what happens when that de-icer hits the ground, what happens when that de-icer hits the ice. So when that de-icer hits the ice, what it's going to start to do is dissolve into the available water as it's melting that ice. Now some de-icers, such as calcium chloride, mag chloride, there's what's called exothermic, which means that as they're dissolving, they're releasing heat. But there can be different degrees of how exothermic something is. So calcium chloride is quite exothermic. Calcium chloride is actually the most exothermic de-icer, a uh, chloride-based de-icer that's out there. So when you put calcium chloride down, you're actually going to see quite a heat increase as compared to mag chloride, which means that calcium chloride can melt faster than magnesium chloride. But you don't just have to take my word for it. Here I have some water, some calcium chloride, some Peladow, and some magnesium chloride. And what I'll do is I'll put the de-icer in the water and you can watch the temperature rise. So, here we go. So as you can see from this experiment, there was a significant difference in temperature rise between the calcium chloride and the magnesium chloride. Uh, the calcium chloride released quite a bit more heat, meaning that the calcium chloride will melt faster when it goes down onto your driveway, onto your sidewalk. And so since it melts faster, you can actually use less to get the same results as with a competitive product. And when it comes to Peladow, less is more.